this part of the game. And well, I asked him if I could help. I borrowed his memory card just to check if there was anything wrong. And that guy literally had never used the sphere, sphere grid. So my friend was going to the game not using the sphere grid at all. And still managed to reach this part of the game What's going without on? leveling up anyone. Eh? Kind of surprising when you think about it. Um, the and obviously once, Even going uh, the teaching, once the sphere grid was filled up, the good. Uh, he had no issues Blanca, whatsoever I think uh, continuing through the game. Mm. <laughs> Sorry about that. Hmm. I can uh, only speculate. There's this nice smell of banana in here. Ask Just yourself. took out two banana bread from the oven. It's gonna taste good for breakfast tomorrow. Ah, Sir Oran, it is an honor. I would be most interested in hearing what you've been doing these past ten years. I've got nothing to say about it. Oh. I see. That Sir was surprising, because it's true, Oren was Your Grace. guardian of There's no need Lord Braska, father of Yuna, and Excuse me. was also Mr. in Zanarkand with Titus, Why is so your lordship you kind of wonder, how did he get there? Sir, Why did he go there? As you normally would. Some of us already know if we get the game. Against the teachings of Yevon? Aren't if you, you never did them? the game, you're gonna learn it later. I should. Or I might mm -hmm. spoil it However, by accident too. Both Who knows? the Crusaders and the Albed truly wish peace for Spira. This Operation Mehen was born from that wish yep. they share. Operation Mehen born Although from the wish that Yevon, uh, their intentions everyone are shares pure. of defeating Sin. And I, Seymour Guado, the person, not the Maester of Yevon. As a denizen of Spira, I wish them well in their endeavor. But using Thank Makara, you, Mr. Seymour, for uh, the encouragement. Didn't see them. <gasps> Beg your pardon, but that's not something a maester should say. Definitely not. Then pretend I didn't say it. You're kidding. From the first time I laid eyes on him, I never did like Seymour. Fucking shit, fruit fly. I but swear you know, to God I'm gonna kill some someone he said if, that if day, I cannot kill that fly. They made a lot of sense to me. Yes. No. Was... Was on the table. Thought it was... Oh, for God's sake. Right. Let's continue. And if we talk to people, they are going to give us some items, so we will do that because more items is always appreciated. Excuse me, Lady Summoner Yuna? Yes. The command center. Maester Seymour requests your presence there, ma'am. I am... Um, Thank you. Take that road to the command center. It's not far. We're still in the midst of preparations this way. Sorry. Sorry about that. I had to adjust the volume of uh, my monitor because, yeah, it was heading into the microphone. So I'm sorry if you had a little bit of, uh, of echo over there. Now it seems to be good if I attack monsters. Yeah, it's not perfect yet, though I did do my quest before, which is what annoys me. Um... So let's do it this way. Should help. That should not be too bad.
let's keep going toward the command center of operation. Oh, oh, I had a great turn. <laughs> Sneak past the guards, I did. Uh, what do you have as weapons? Nope, I'm interested. I don't want. I don't want. I don't want. Nothing interesting. Uh, with Operation Mead, oh well. Prices. But you, lad, you get a discount. I owe you one, eh? Yeah, when the characters are talking, it goes into the microphone. Because there's still sound coming from both ways. Well, let's continue. Let me know if you hear anything weird uh, on your side. Should be fine. I guess if I did some tests uh, previously, but the where it seems that uh, there are issues is when when characters are talking mostly, and seems that attacking also causes noise issues. So we'll see. But now that I think about it, I need to get my overdrive for the various Aeons. So uh, I'm gonna bring Yuna. And I'm gonna summon Bellafor, which is okay, good. The only Aeon without overdrive, so I still have it from I3. a little bit of a noisy. Here. Okay. Wrong one. Okay. Happen. That's what happened. I kill him now. Uh, yep, good. Got my overdrive. Yep. Oh, yeah. Up, go down to and uh, yeah, should be all good. Let's say like this. So, should be fine, and uh, yeah, next would be Waka. I have only one turn, right? Bring it on. Okay, so then you walk up. And yeah, cool. Well, I have some level up. I think I'll be fine now. Let me know if there is anything weird on your side, guys. Uh, seems I had everything covered up, but maybe not. So. We'll see, we'll see, we'll see. Uh, anything special for Waka here? I only have an HP sphere, which I think I'm giving to Yuna at this stage. Uh, Yuna, 675. Titus, 920. Yeah, Yuna is getting an more HP. And she soon will have. She already has more than Titus now because of that. Okay. I just will have to wait to move forward because I don't have ability sphere right now. So let's just continue toward Operation Mehan. Following Elma from the Chocobo Knights. Yeah, this seems to be doing the trick in terms of uh, noise reduction. This noise hit. Ah, oh, come on. Freaking ambush. Fucking hate that. Don't you hate ambushes? Uh, okay, so I'm gonna need Orin. What well, doesn't attack that? And the Lulu is gonna take care of the fighter friend.
Orin level up. Still no ability sphere, which really sucks. I need ability spheres. I don't know when or where I will get some. Thousand gills. Ten potions. I'll take those. Wonder in that. Uh, 100% playthrough. Should I try to get all the mixes for Riku's overdrive? That could be interesting. Good. So, at the preemptive strike, therefore I can bring other character into the mix just for the experience. Don't even have to properly use them. Miss me? And Lulu's gonna come and use her blizzard once again. Yeah, more levels, still no ability sphere. Come on, for fuck's sake. I know later in the game I won't need any more. Years, but at this moment, it just greatly sucks. Uh, which one? That one. We can see a uh, safe sphere down there in the gorge. It's gonna come to use later when we have the airship. Because when we have the airship, we'll be able to... Uh, let's put a no blaze on everyone here. Because of the little uh, mushroom thingy, I'm not confident. Uh, but yeah, once we get the airship, we'll be able to go down where that safe sphere is and get... I'm not sure which item might be a uh, special weapon. Okay, so I'm it's kind of R in there. I'm gonna wait on Lulu, who will use fire in order to beat that thing. Uh, but I can bring Titus for an extra turn. Okay, and now we. Fly is fucking back. I swear to god, I'm gonna kill this bitch. Uh, okay, so Titus is gonna wait for the ability sphere. But we can move Auron. Uh, yeah. Treasure chest. Remedy is not what I want, though useful. So what do we have here? Enemies for everyone. Good job. This week was also the 21st anniversary of Final Fantasy X. Had a stream on uh, Tuesday to celebrate that. 21 years since it was released in Japan. I couldn't just sit there. So I decided that I would do everything in my power to help them. Yep, if you cannot beat them, might as well join them. That's what Shalinda is doing now. Since, in the end, what everyone wants is to defeat Sin. Ooh, yeah, that was powerful. Thank you, Oren, for this critical hit, allowing us to beat these two enemies. 
in one go. Ah, uh, speed and mana, still no ability sphere. But uh, for sure I'm gonna get some soon because here Ludu has more magic to learn, so... I think it's more around the Jose High Road that they become available. I don't remember having this issue when I first played the game, so I don't know what happened. And we have the same three enemies once again. Our friend there, we're gonna use Blizzard. My nickel friend. At least these guys only do fire and they don't uh, actually use the sleeping attack. Or maybe they do, but I don't remember. Anyway, there you go. Kimari instant kill. is also gonna need some ability sphere soon eh. and so is Yuna <laughs> fucking shit uh, Auron also has oh yeah Auron more strength yeah, I took the trigger chest was just not sure and we are going up to the command, toward the command center, not yet at the command center. Um, so what's there to see around here? There are people to talk to, of course. Uh, here there's nothing. I don't entirely remember what there is to see. Treasure chest on this side, I don't remember. We're gonna find out. Worst case, it's gonna be uh, more battles. So, we're gonna bring Lulu for a sure kill of this guy. And then uh, Sir Auron. Which. It's still not powerful enough to kill that guy in one go. But we have an extra turn, so we're gonna bring Waka to guard. Yuna. And Kamari. Everyone gets experience. Everyone is happy. So let's check here. I'm. There's this guy to talk to. Fly, stop fucking moving. I swear to god. I'm sorry about the clapping noise. I'm I'm about to go crazy, I swear to you. Uh, so okay, let's check here, is there? I don't think there's anything that way before we get the spheres, but I'm, ju I, I'm just not sure, so I want to, uh, to verify the 100% confidence that we're not missing anything. Let's end this. I foresee no difficulty. You don't? Nah, it's not a tough fight either. I could have used you know with no blaze to protect everyone from fire, but there's gonna be a save uh, close from here, so it's no big deal. So Yuna can still move one slot before she's stuck. Because she will need an ability spear. Kumari is good for now. I just cannot move. Lulu can move. Right. So let's 
check. Okay, so as I recall, there is there is nothing here, right? Uh, so that was a loss of time, but uh, yeah, that happened. Like I have missed something, but I don't remember what. It's genuinely suck. Let's protect everyone from fire. No blade. Good, so we're gonna bring Kamari for one turn. He can attack. Ooh, pretty cool hit. Alright, nice experience for Waka and Aurum. Still lacking ability sphere for Titus. It's gonna be stuck. Oops, nope. It's gonna be stuck for a while. Yuna will be stuck there until I have ability spheres for her too. Uh, did I? No, I did not miss anything. Ah! So we're going up this way. And uh, yeah, we're soon gonna have a little cutscene with Gata and Luzu. Well, especially with Luzu. And ooh, this is uh, an enemy I don't like. So let's use Dark Attack. Which will make sure that he. What? Ah, it's true that it's not because you are dark that you, the enemy is not gonna touch you. But come on. Don't be an ass like that. Now hopefully this one will miss. Good. So uh, we can bring you enough for a turn quickly. I'm gonna bring Titus and Aaron now and finish the fight with our powerful party. So be it. And bring Kimari since he's got full health. And at this point is relatively strong thanks to his piercing ability and what he's got on his uh, weapon. And let's finish this now. Oh yeah, overkill. Will this guy give me an ability sphere? Hi, <sighs> this is stuck. I need ability spheres. All right, so there's a save here to get back some health. Sir, I want to fight too. Orders are orders. I'm not a cadet so anymore, this is where sir. we learn that Gata is the stuff that he I'll cannot fight on Operation Meehan. Guarding the command center is important too, you know. But I came all the way from Besay to fight Sin, sir. I know, but an order's an order to your post crusader. Sir! And I knew I missed something down there. Before I go talk to Luzu, I'm gonna go get what I missed, even though it means more battles. I knew I freaking missed something. That is a shitty fight. Oh, fuck. Well, let's at least dark this one. 
Damn, that's a shitty fight. Let's bring you enough to no blaze until you have another turn for Lulu. Shroom. All right. Let's try to finish this no birdie thing. He's gonna attack, attack us at least once. Ah, with Sunny Boom. Now we can finish our weapon pretty fun finish. If our just a little bit of luck. 456. Ah, ah, ah. I hate for that. Come on, stop with your stupid side boom. So if you're wondering why I'm not moving Titus or Yuna, it's because I need ability spheres, which I currently don't have. Uh, and yeah, we're gonna go back this way for Kamari. And soon Aaron's gonna need one too. Oh my god, this really this sucks at the moment. Uh, I can unlock the level one here for Lulu. That's good. And Waka can also move. But Waka's also gonna get stuck. Ah, fucking shit. Ah. If I'm trailing back here, it's because I knew, I just knew I missed something. Right? Around there. Yes, here. I knew there was a fucking treasure chest. I fucking knew it. And we're gonna get it. There. Ah! Well, at least that's a more conventional battle, but I'm fucking ambushed. Oh. Right, let's keep going. What the... I just was on the edge. So to anyone joining, this is... Part 3 of a completionist run of Final Fantasy X, where I will do the main story, then get everybody's celestial weapon, all the beat all the monsters uh, at the arena, actually beat the final monster at the arena mostly. And that's not the magic I wanted to use. And um, yeah, also max out everybody's stats to 255 and as much HP as possible after that. That's what I want to do. Ability. Finally, treasure chest with 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 serene armlet for Kamari. So fire, ice, lightning ward, dark ward, berserk ward. I am gonna leave him with the red armlet for now, but for sure the berserk ward is something that I really want for later in the game, shortly before the fight with Yunaleska. Uh, because it is useful to have someone who will not turn berserk. Now, finally, I can truly move on. And this is, uh, yeah, pretty much it. Uh, none. Ambushed again. Come on, come on, come on. 
And we have Daniel G26 now following. Thank you, Daniel. How are you doing, buddy? Leave a comment in the chat. Say hi. I'm happy to see you here this afternoon, evening, whatever time it is for you. Everybody to sleep. This will really suck. Uh, but it's only for, I think, three turns. But the fact that this guy is using fire is a real bother. Uh, Ludo is asleep, therefore, I will bring Kamari. And attack like this. Good. We've got more level up. So let's go here. Defense 4 for Ruby. That's nice. Uh, Kamari can still move. Waka can still move, but will soon be stuck because I lack ability. Sphere. Uh, you're not gonna move. Yeah. That's uh, the sad place I'm at right now. Characters who are stuck because I am out of ability spheres. Oops. Now, let's go to that scene with Luzu. Finally, let's move on with the game. They let you through, huh? Hmm. Kata deserves better. At least there's no chance he'll get hurt. Why are you guys fighting anyway? Aren't the almighty Albed Machina enough? They still need some time to get them ready. Our job is to keep Sin at bay till they're done. So the Crusaders are keeping Sins at bay, and the Albed are gonna try to get more Waka. stuff. Done. I might not get another chance to say this. It's about your brother. Luzu, the old no. fella. Oh yeah, we're gonna learn about Chapu. What? I'm the one who convinced him to enlist. <sighs> I'm sorry. Yep, that's deserved. I mean, if not for Luzu, Chapu would enough. still be alive at this moment. Maybe, because as when he just we used said, to play Blitz together, Chapu used to say, "Yeah, nice story here." You he say that when we won the cup, yeah, he proposed to Lulu. That's the relationship that they had. Uh, and then one day, uh. he goes off and becomes a crusader, just like that. Chapu also said to me that being with your girl is good. But keeping Sin far away from her... I like that uh, in that cutscene you can see that Luzu's cheek is slightly red, uh, thanks to the hit that he got from Waka. Lu. You knew? Luzu told me before we left. <laughs> she she me too. too. All crusaders Which in is the funny Vanguard enough, in my opinion. On the beach. That's my cue. <laughs> and now we are truly heading for the command Luzu, center and the actual operation. Me him. So you can hit me more? Lots, lots more. <laughs> Suluzu, please, please don't go. I have to, Yuna. Let him go. 
the man has already chosen his path. As you did when you became a summoner. Yep. And those words hold a lot of meaning that, I mean, Tidus would not understand at this point it because be a long time he lacks knowledge. Before I ever really understood the reason why Yuna let Luzu pass yep. that day. It would be a while before he understood. It's gonna be actually probably until uh, Bikinel Island, somewhere around that. You know, the Albed home. And here's the shitty fight once again. Starting with a sunny boom from the enemy there. Um, so we're gonna bring, we're gonna bring Titus. We can use this overdrive since uh, we want to use Titus's overdrive a hundred times to get Blitz Ace later in the game, so let's just do this quickly. Uh, fire like this. Good. Um, we're gonna bring Waka for a dark attack on the big bird. And thank god the mushroom is using fire this time. Now big bird. Right. Yuna can cure a little. Marley is the one that did not attack yet. Let's kill the mushroom, or whatever that is. And finally, let's turn back Auron. The Marley is going to keep attacking. And uh, yeah, we can keep using Lulu here. I think it's more powerful than Titus. It sure is. So, this is gonna be kill next turn. Why am I using thunder? There's no real reason. Just feel like using thunder. I think it's just fun using thunder. Thunder, 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 boom, boom, boom. Still no ability sphere. Getting stuck in the sphere grid because of that. Waka can move all the way here and everyone else is fucking stuck. Anyway, let's move up to the command center and see what we can do. It's gonna be the start of Operation Meehan, an attempt at defeating Sin. Take a look at the various preparations. Albed Makena, forbidden by the Yevan clergy, but in this effort, both the Albeds and the Crusaders and everyone in Spira wants to get rid of Sin. If it can work, I guess using Makena is not such a bad idea. But will it work? That's the other he big question. Really hates them, huh? Chapu, he left the sword Waka gave him in Besaid, and he fought with an Albed Machina weapon instead. Uh, that's this got nothing, nothing to do with, with it. it. I just, just hate these sacrilegious contraptions. contraptions. And can I get more items from these guys? Nope. So let's just continue. And uh, yeah, we are approaching another interesting part of the game. Where, yeah, we're gonna have some long cutscenes. We're gonna see how Operation Meehan unfolds. Will they be able to defeat Sin? Maybe. Who knows? If anyone is just joining, this is part 3 of many upcoming parts of Final Fantasy X 
aimed at getting 100% in that game, meaning completing the story, getting all the celestial weapon, beating uh, the final fiend at the Calmland Arena, and uh, maxing out everybody's set to 255 anyway. plus a lot of Don't HP. It might be a hopeless campaign. It is it technically impossible to get heaven, everybody's HP to 99,999 if I max up the stats to 255. Therefore, it's going to be 255 stats and as much and HP that's just as possible. What we want too, isn't it? Isn't it? But if you have an armor right, with break HP limit but I still think and HP plus 30%, for a reason. if that's a thing, Lady Sunda, then there you are. it is technically the possible. Center is that way. Maester Keenock is also there. I think. Maester Keenock no, 67,000 yes. plus hurry, 30% is still not 99,000. Close enough though. Probably the closest you can get for real. So let's move that way. We're gonna meet with Mr. Keenock. Uh, no, I don't think we know anything. Oh, apparently, you're not to pass, but uh, we're gonna save. And keep going to meet him. I the guess. The operation will begin shortly. Please check all your equipment. Mm. You all right? Of course not. I came here to fight sin, but they stick me here. Mm. If you want to prove yourself. Huh? First, you must complete the tasks you are given. That is true. And not just for the Crusaders, but for any job, basically. Just doing what they say. It just won't be enough. And uh, I decide to keep Gata alive, so guarding the command center is important. You'd think the same if you were me. You do something, even if it means bending the rules. Please don't guard the command center. Got to show Luzu what I can do. Please don't. Oh, Mr. Keenock. I had heard from Seymour, but I didn't know if we'd actually meet. Good to see you, Oren. Ten years, is it? <laughs> so they know each other. Oh, I'm not sure I remember. That's I think it's explained Kinoch, in one of the, one of the Jets of here at some point. He leads the warrior monks, and also commands the Crusaders. All troops ready to move at your command, sir. Good. Dismissed. Sir! So that is Gata. You should stay alive. Tell me, Oren, where have you been the last ten years? We don't have time for this now, do we? This plan won't work. You know that. We'll just let them dream a little longer. Uh... What? Mr. Keenock is Kinoch. not as dumb as he looks oh, like. Oh, yes. Proceed. Or the priest. That Keenock a maester? Huh? I heard that, Oren. A lot has happened in the last ten years. What were you doing and where? Fulfilling a promise I made to a friend. They definitely have still am. a relationship that they Just expect tell me one year then. Something special. Hm. So you also heard about Zanarkand. I kinda think we don't belong here and that is it is time at last interesting we must tell the albed waiting outside to begin the operation at once the fiends may break through this place is not safe make sure you're prepared to defend yourselves tell me when all right ready. let's check our equipment once again uh, I know there's a treasure chest somewhere Not yeah, there's one here. But I believe there's more that I actually missed. Oh yeah, there's one there. 
Officer and Bracer. That's nice. I think that's also Berserk Ward and for Auron. And isn't there another treasure chest? Somewhere just around Oakata oh, Twin Third. But I. No, I think I. I think I got them all. Alright. So let's head toward this Crusader. Uh. I can still check the equipment I just got, which is Oren's uh, Serene Bracer. Yeah, HP plus 5, Berserk Ward. Ah, I've got HP plus 5. And, uh, what else did I get? I don't even remember. Did I get a weapon? No. I feel like I got. Soldier, Sabres, Strength plus 10. I could give Titus that, but I'll leave him with the Brotherhood for now, just because I want to leave him with the Brotherhood for now. Just because. I don't remember what else I got. Whatever. Uh, I'm gonna save my game and start Operation Me. Uh, no need to save, it's all gonna be fine. I've got all my health. Cool, let's start. Oops. Are you ready? Yep, we are ready. Let's begin Mr. Keenock, Operation please. Mehan. Will Sin come? Sin always returns for its spawn. To make sure, we're going to encourage them to call out to it. You won't have to. It'll come. I remembered Oren telling me. Sin, Sin is, is my coming man. for Titus. Sin is jacked. So this is gonna be interesting. We're gonna fight some Sin spawn that break loose. Looking monster. Seems like uh, he could be my friend. Or maybe not. Who knows? But uh, everyone's gonna attack, so Kamari, we're gonna use uh, Fire Breath on everything. Ouch. Lulu can overdrive with uh, Thunder Fury. I believe the head does not like thunder, but I could be wrong. Orin will attack with Dragon Fang. Uh, weapons are. Two arms are killed. Pretty good. Pretty good. Brute fly around. Ah. The head. I'll cast a spell on its head. Yep, be careful for the head. Oh shit. Um I'm gonna be careful of the head first, so I'm gonna use Waka to hit the head like this. And for Lulu that really sucks. Thunder should be fine. Gonna bring uh, Titus for one attack. And then what we're gonna do? Hit Demi. It's not that bad. Gonna bring Yuna. Gonna use life on the Lulu. And hopefully she will survive one more attack. She needs to attack again to get the experience though. So, uh, yeah, pretty much gotta wait for now and give her haste at least. Ah, uh, damn fruit fly. Uh, I can bring Orin for one turn, even though I could have done fuel on the instead. Fourth 
fuck's sake. This really sucks at the moment, because I need to have Lulu attack once in order to uh, get the experience. And I probably should have done haste on Orin right from the start. But we're gonna bring Waka, who's gonna attack the head. That's good for now. Oh, for fuck's sake. Is this a fucking joke? Here, here I think I missed... I missed to use haste. I mean, this is probably one of the first things I should have done, is bring the Aeons and fight. Instead of waiting. But, okay. Now, I'm gonna... Yeah, protect? No. But I'm gonna cure Lulu. So that hopefully she can serve. Okay, good. It's Demi, so that's uh, decent enough for me. I'm gonna bring Oren back. Next is Lulu. Uh, okay, so let's do this. Oren's gonna kill one arm with a critical hit. I'm gonna have Lulu you attack the head. Now all I need is to have Yuna come for one turn. Okay, that is really suspiciously. That's good. I'll probably summon Ifrit. That's what I should have done from the start. I would have killed the head with Ifrit. Then use Valakor who would have also done a lot of damage. Because obviously he will not kill the old enemy. I guess I'm getting rusty uh, at Final Fantasy X. But now, Hellfire. Let Hell break loose. Let's see how much damage it's gonna do. That's gonna be pretty nice. <sighs> Sorry for this little silence moment. I had the uh, Important message to answer. But, uh, I can attack again, so let's use Hellfire once again. That's uh, that's lucky, I think. And uh, yes, I do leave the full summoning animation because uh, I think that's just cool. I think it does look cool. What do you think? Does the summon animation look cool? To you? is not a big worry and ooh a miss nice 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 to me again I can actually heal myself with fire which may it will it be enough to be able to use overdrive once again holy <laughs> five <laughs> um uh, yeah, let's just try for fun if, just in case, he does another attack that will not kill me. Yes! Overdrive once again. Yes! Come on, come on. I think this will be a 3 overdrive for i3 in this fight. Oh, yes. But for sure, next attack, he's dead.
I just think that's funny. Okay, so finally I can get through this fight, uh, which uh, did cause me some issues at the beginning, but now it's all good. Let's just get through everything and uh, everything will be alright, finally. Uh, I guess I got 2800 left, so for now I can still use... And, yep, and let's use this ballet 4. I know on the uh, on the Jose Harold later toward the moon flow, I'm gonna have to fight against Belgamine, but I will have time to get back all my overdrives for all my Aeons until then, so no worries, all good. Overdrive, energy rate. So what's the weather like at uh, your places, guys? Here it's been... Ah, sorry. It's been pretty warm all week. Uh, at the air conditioning on all week because it's just crazy i'm fine with heat but like it's it's the humidity that we have uh around here that is just crazy oh here we have uh, pretty neat cutscenes uh the checkable knights and the crusaders yeah. going to attack sin and uh well it's not gonna end well for Spira. For everyone, it's gonna be a pretty sad scene to watch. And uh, you know what? I think uh, while we have this cutscene. I will actually uh, go for a piss. I'll be back. Look out. just in time to fight with Seymour. Thank you for watching and for being patient, you bunch of lovely monkeys joining me for the stream. And uh, I'm not gonna lose time trying to get Seymour's overdrive. Uh, it's gonna take way too long, so let's just fight uh, normally and get rid of this enemy as quick as possible. So we have Oren, Seymour and Yuna. Uh, so it's gonna be black magic from Dara on the head to kill it first thing. Uh, you and I can, you can cure people for now. I guess the best Aran can do at the moment is kill the arms until Seymour can attack. Four to five turns and kill this part of the enemy. Uh, Yuna cannot do much, honestly. This is weak. <laughs> uh, what I? Uh, so. 
it allows us to see the level 2 magic, at least. Magic does Seymour has nothing special to it. So it would be two more attacks by Seymour in order to finish off the enemy. And he's gonna finish him off before I kill the second one. Whoops, that was a mistake. So no, he will not finish the enemy before I kill the second one. Here's a miss. Uh, Alright, so... Still, that Seymour can have an attack of 271. Uh, I'm curious to see what his weapon is. Can we check what Seymour's weapon is? Nope, I cannot check Seymour's weapon. So, let's finish this thing off. Oh yeah! That was easy. Prove that Mr. Seymour is almighty and powerful. And hopefully I'll get some ability spheres now. Will I? Still not. Uh, whoops. The others. So now we're gonna have a pretty sad sight. Here's the all or nothing technique, but there's this kind of armor around Sin. Like, Sin can do some pretty sick shit to defend itself. And, you know, for a while this seems like it had potential to succeed. And this all dead electric cannon, whatever that is. Like, you thought that just maybe, you know, increasing power now, shrinking, shrinking the armor, maybe touching it. But, bam! This... This is an awful sight to see. Like, what's going on with those guys in the... In the pilot seat and... Yeah, that, that's just awful. I can understand... The way Yuna is looking at that is just... Just really sad, to be honest. There's just nothing that can defeat Sin other than summoners. What we have here is desolation and death all around. This is what Sin does. It brings death. There's nothing that can be done about that. Yeah, the the hymn of the fate is well deserved. May all these soul reach the far plane, and may heaven watch on them. Wherever they are now. Uh, confusion, sadness, death. This is what we have around here. Uh, so as I level up, still no ability sphere, so I am unable to move Titus. I can still move Auron a few nodes, but he's also gonna get stuck if I cannot get the ability sphere real soon. Yuna cannot move, Titus cannot move, Kimari can move. Uh, so we're gonna go with that way, I guess. 
What do you want him to go after that? I want him to go tie this it's away, so I guess I'm gonna come... Or do I? Do I do I not? I don't know what to fucking do with Kamari. I'm... Yeah, once he's done, I'm gonna bring him back and move him tie this way, so... Let's just go like this. If I genuinely lost a few, uh, a bit of time there. Um, let's cure everyone. Even though there will be a save close by, it was soon. Um, let's try to see what's going on around here. Devastation, death. I do believe Gata is somewhere. There he is. He is alive. What's going That's on? the good news. Why? What? But that also means What's that Luzu is dead. Let's witness the end of Operation Mihan. Don't you run away from me! And playing in the background soundtrack, someday the dreams will end. By the way, question of the day! Uh, exclamation mark QOTD in the chat. What is your favorite soundtrack of Final Fantasy X? Let me know in the comments. And. Uh, we can maybe have a little debate about which soundtrack is the best. You can't. Ah, you're not trying to summon, but it won't be enough to defeat Sun. She needs the final summoning from Zanarkin in order to defeat it. As for Titus, what is he doing now? Chasing after Sin. There is no way you can catch him. So, all this overwhelming feeling and everything. I have no idea what I was thinking when I ran after Sin that day. Yep. Before I knew what I was doing, there I was, chasing him down like a thief at market. Maybe I was angry. Maybe I wanted to go home. I just, just wants answer. And he just wants man. answer, which he doesn't have, and you know cannot really get because Oren won't tell him anything, and he also doesn't know anything about Spira. Titus, I mean, Oren knows everything, but Titus doesn't know anything about Spira. And you know, this is a funny sight we're seeing now because this is this area inside sin at the pretty much at the end of uh, of the game so you may be just maybe at the moment sins toxins are playing some tricks in titus's head but also the fact that we're seeing uh bahamut fate mean that you know he everything is linked with sin with the fireflies with death with the circle of death um, it's tough to know. But my guess would be that at this specific moment, it, like right now, this is Sin's toxins playing tricks in Titus's head more than anything. Even though there's a link with Jack right now and with Zamarkand, actually be a mix of both. The fact that he's closing on to Jack and that sin stops him could be playing tricks on his mind. You just said to kill. <laughs> Tomorrow, maybe. Why not today? Why do today when you can leave for tomorrow? No, I'd rather do today instead of leaving stuff for tomorrow.
I thought I sensed my old man there. Somewhere. Or maybe it was just Sin's toxin playing tricks on my mind. <sighs> How many died today? Too many died today. People die, and Yuna dances. And Yuna is when dancing, stop doing dancing? something. Which is, when will it stop? I said, ready, sad. Yuna won't stop dancing. Not until Sin is gone. And Sin Those won't be gone then, anytime I soon. I mean, not until we reach Zanarkand. I see you're still here. Huh? Many stories ended here today. But yours goes on, I see. What? It sure does. Sin had come and gone, but I remained here. Yep. This time you did not change world. So you are staying in Spira, young Titus. Time to save. Now we're gonna head to the temple in Jose. A swift retreat. Satisfied? What do you mean? Eh. Those who turned from Yevon died, while the faithful live on. Hmm. The past ten years have changed you, I see. Yeah, that's kind of what it means, you know, Crusaders and all beds turned on the heaven for this Operation Mehan. But you do not look so only well. those who believe in the heaven are but still alive right now. Ever, you must be the people's strength. Their confidence. <laughs> Anyone else would be expected to show their sorrow. But you are a summoner. You are Spira's hope. Until sin is defeated, you must not relent. A few words of encouragement from Seymour, who, yes. you know, at this stage in the game, I understand. pretty much looks like a friend, even though afraid? his looks does not make it look like a friend, I think. Offering Yuna, some good word of advice. Take me as your pillar of strength. As Unaleska had her Lord Zeon. Hmm. Well, he has the typical look Lady of Yuna, a big villain. Until next we meet. But I think Farewell. his voice acting is really good at making making him look like a potential friend in all of that. So let's talk to Aurum a little bit. Sin is checked. Yeah. For a while there, I thought I could feel him. But that doesn't mean I believe you. Sin is checked. He came here for you. So he killed all those people just for a chance to see me? That's what, That's Sin, what does. Sin does. He wanted to show that to you. Do you know why? How am I supposed to know? So you would kill him. Project as wants long as he is sin. And Jack will keep killing. He wants you to stop him. You gotta be kidding. How do you know all of this anyway? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not done talking to you. Don't you run away. You're the one running. Yes, Titus is the one running. I'll agree with that. I have a treasure chest here. Let's grab it. Potion. I want ability spheres for fuck's sake Now all right time to move on I'm pretty sure I will get ability spheres where I'm going but It is gonna be a real butter <laughs> 